Hey everyone, welcome to Heavy Metal. Another day out here on the range and it's cold out here. You know, we got some snow yesterday and what is it right now? Oh, fantastic. It is below freezing. It is exactly 30 degrees out. I like this thermometer though, it's cold. But anyway, I can't control the weather, so what you gonna do? Get out here and do some shooting and have a little fun. All right, today what we're going to do, I brought out the uh, Savage. What is this, the Model 93? And this is in uh, 22 Magnum. This cool little rifle this actually belongs to Hootie Who. Appreciate the loan. And we're going to be uh, zinging some over the chronograph today. I have three, and we're going to see which one has the most get up and go. Uh, first up, I have some of this Norma. This is 40 grain, jacketed hollow point. Now it says on here, 1885 feet per second. And uh, as you can see, them are just, you know, basic. And then second up, I have this Remington uh, Premier Magnum. Now these are 33 grain AccuTip V. And I know last time I was going through here and I actually pulled out the wrong bullets because as you can see, this is a mixed box. But this time I will pay attention and get the uh, correct one out. I'll show you what the correct one looks like. Pretty good. I didn't dump them all out on the ground. That's what the cracked one looks like. You've got that little polymer, I think it's a polymer tip on it, which is pretty cool. Then last, not 150% sure, but I got this box here. And they all look the same. Uh, it just says CCI on it. So apparently the label came off or what have you. But uh, seem like a brand new box, and like I say, they're all the same. I'm going to assume that's a 40 grain uh, little hollow point. So that'll give us a good three to choose from. And like I say, we'll zing them across the chronograph. And then uh, when we're done, there's a little bonus. Got a shaving cream out there. And I want to try one of these 33 grains Accu tips on that shaving cream. I think that'll be a trip. Let me get the chronograph cranked up and we'll get to shooting and we'll see how fast each one of these 22 mags really is. Alright guys, got a chronograph cranked up. Let's go ahead and start with this uh, Norma. I've got three of them out here. Yeah, I'm only shooting three each because as y'all know, ammo's hard to get nowadays. I don't care what caliber you're after. And these normas are the uh, little hollow points, if I didn't tell you that before. 40 grain. Uh, shot a lot of normal. Uh, good ammo. Never had no trouble out of it. And the accuracy seems to be there. So, uh, with that being said, let's not shoot the chronograph. And guys, we're only about... Uh, what is this, maybe 10 feet, eight to 10 feet away from the chronograph. I'm hoping that it'll pick up since it's so uh, cloudy out. All right, first shot with our Norma 40 grain. Ooh, that thing's booking it. 1768 and 1853 I will stick them averages right up here all right next up is our CCI I'll tell you what that Norma uh, stuff was no joke 
Got some zoom in little bullets there. And the CCIs, they, uh, they have the appearance just like the normal. Just a basic little hollow point. Three of them. what this CCI is going to do for us. A 1763. 1761. One and two were consistent, weren't they? And the 1723. And I will stick him averages up here. And guys, I know some of you are looking and saying, hey, Paul, you didn't put your ears on. Well, I've got the little uh, earplugs in right now. I'll put them in earlier. Uh, I may use them later, shooting some other stuff. But for now, just little earplugs are fine for me with these 22. Alright guys, see we got some pretty quick bullets going on there. Now this Remington, and this is 33 grains, a whole lot lighter. I mean we're talking a 7 grain difference there, which when you're talking 22, uh, that's a good difference. Got it loaded, didn't I? Yeah, cold hands. Not the easiest to load up. Could have swore I pulled four of them out. No telling, I probably dropped it. No, in May. Alright, now let's see how quick this 33 grain 22 mags will be. Nineteen sixteen. Nineteen thirty-nine. And a nineteen fifteen. Well, that was far out. Actually, I'll put them averages up here. And then we're going to throw up all three of them with the averages for y'all to see. Well, guys, it's plain who the winner was there. This little uh, 33 grain Remington uh, V, what do they call that? AccuTip V. That stuff is quick. And really uh, showed out well on a chronograph. All right. I wanted to take a shot of that and check out the shaving cream. So, uh, Let's make a shot. You know it's going to be fun. All right. A little way because AccuTip V. I don't know why I keep getting that. 33 gains, greens, versus the shaving cream. I'd say it should splatter pretty good uh, if I don't miss it. And I don't think I need all the zoom for this one. Didn't miss it. Man, that thing splattered up pretty good. I assume it went all the way through there. Let's check it. Oh yeah, no doubt. There was our entrance. Well, let me wipe this off a little bit. You can see it a little better. Yeah, now you can see it a little better. There was our entrance right there. And check out that exit. 
Man, that thing just went ham on that shaving cream. Awesome, awesome. I got shaving cream, I love my gloves. Well, so is life. Well, guys, uh, that's going to wrap this one up. Appreciate you watching. I hope you enjoyed that. I enjoyed shooting it. I like this rifle. I like the 22 mag. I'm going to do some more with the uh, 22 mag this week, no doubt. Just a lot of fun to shoot. Well, everyone, if you would, throw me down some comments. Uh, if you're able, hit us up on Patreon. And please, like, share, and subscribe. Again, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Until the next one, I hope that everyone has a fantastic day.